we're enjoying a little break in the rain, but that's not going to last. Not really, and even today we're already going to start seeing this like drizzle and foggy conditions already. So uh, preparation is key. We've learned a lot about that with the recent storms we've had in the past couple of months, but here comes another one. Let's take a look at our temperatures right now, though. 53 for Cambria, San Luis Obispo, the same. Santa Barbara, 54. Our inland areas a little bit cooler, 45 for California Valley. Now we're talking about foggy conditions, clouds making their way to the central coast, and that's been happening already, kind of letting us know that we have a storm on its way. Uh, this ra radar showing us a lot of action across the country. So on the east coast, northeast are bringing snow, and then on the west coast, we have the atmospheric river and rain. So let's take a look at this regional outlook, though. You can see some of those red arrows showing those winds coming in from the south. If we try to time it out, you can see clouds dominating the forecast, but then rain starts making its way. As we head into Tuesday, that's when we're going to see most of the action here locally. Now, we did see a lot of rain, so this is an area of concern as well. So let's take a look uh, at our model here. You can see clouds again into this afternoon and then kind of drizzle here and there, pockets of light rain, and then into tonight. That's when we're going to start seeing that heavy rain, pockets of heavy rain, especially in our north coast. So Cambria, San Luis Obispo also going to see some of that heavy rain as we head into Tuesday. How much can we get? We're taking a look, maybe two to four inches in our coastal valleys, but we can even see three to six in our mountains and hills. This model showing us three and a half inches for San Luis Obispo, Cambria too. It could go up because of that amount of rain expected. We do have a flood watch in effect starting today at 10 a.m. and it goes into to Wednesday at 4 a.m. Winds could also be a concern. There is an advisory in Monterey County. We could see something locally too. I'll step out of the way so we can take a look at our area forecast. You can see lots of 60s, so mid 60s for the most part. As we take a look to our seven day forecast, you can see a little bit of sun cloud mix on Monday, but then Tuesday that rain icon taking over a drop in our temperatures as well. And then we're going to see some of those 60s later in the week, but you see that rain icon coming up one more time on Sunday, so we do have more rain potential. In Santa Maria, we're going to see some of those mid-60s. They're going to see some of that heavier rain Tuesday, Tuesday evening, because that's when it's going to make its way to Santa Barbara County. And again, we do have that potential for another round of rain on Sunday, so preparation is key, and keep that umbrella handy. Back to you. All right, thanks, Claudia. The timer